A new school will start very soon. I hope this will be the last one. Well, it's not my fault that I didn't like all the previous schools. To put it mildly, they were not my level. The only thing that pisses me off is that in the new school, I will have to achieve my favorite goals again. Let's look at them. First, to make my crush love me, although my exes were quite good, but we don't stand still, as they say. Second, to become the most popular girl in school. Well, of course there will be no problems. To buy new clothes and stationery for school. Okay, and the fourth, to get good grades. No way. Do not get myself kicked out of school. That's enough. Oh yes, I'm so excited. But they say this school has a super strict headmaster. But that's okay. We'll see about that. Let's do this. They hate when you elevate. They're stacking up losses, I'm handing them out. Yeah, I had to go delegate. They feel like I'm floating, I'm lost in the moment, I swear. New school. How I dreamed about you. I dreamed so much that I packed all my things. It's damn uncomfortable. I need to take the bag more comfortably. Are you watching your step? Yes. Hey, Roger. Are you deaf? I can only hear our hearts beating. They beat as one. Crazy. Hope we won't be in the same class. In my vein of hope, I studied the photos of all my classmates on the site. And you, Martin, are one of them. Hey, don't you want to help me? Why can't I just say no? Bring your bag yourself. Okay. Come on. What did you bring here? Bricks? Well, these are trifles. 63 volumes about how to plant chrysanthemums in pods, various crossword puzzles, math problems, physics textbooks for high school okay, students, okay, several I got pairs it. of socks. Why list everything? Let's go. Yes, yes. I'm coming. Wow, I can't believe it. The best school in the country. Yeah. And usually in the coolest schools, the most beautiful girls. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Did you get a message with the room number? So, where am I on the list? Here, room number 22. And I'm in 30th, unfortunately. So we're right on the opposite sides. Yeah. Yeah, it's of course a pity that we're not in the same room. It, it, it would be more fun. I mean it. Duh. Exactly. May I get struck by a textbook? I'm standing here and I can't believe it. For me begins a real party. One in a million. 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 Well, quite a nice school. Dad really did his best. Gotta find a phone to take a selfie. What? I think I broke the phone. Dang it, the first day of school. No way! Ah! I am so happy! This is all mine! It's so cool that the girl who lived here before left such coziness. Oh my gosh, the whole room is at my disposal! Damn it, dude. I'll stay at this school for a maximum of a week and I'll be out. You know me. I can't live without you. Hey, miss. You've got the wrong well, room. Well, I miss you too. But will you wait for me? Yeah? I love you too. Bye. I am deeply sorry, but this is my room. You may be mistaken. Honey, it was you who made the mistake when you entered this school. But since the stars align like this, I advise you to sit calm and keep quiet. <laughs> 
The number of my room is 22. Wait, you also got room 22 in the message? I see it's not just your eyesight that's the problem. No, wait. Are you thinking about the same thing I am? Well, if you think you're an annoying, pissed off nerd, then yes, it's the same thing. No way! I think about we are neighbors. Besties! Back off, don't touch me. Only my boyfriend can hug me. By the way, we've been together for a month. Looking at it from a philosophical point of view, a month is not like a lot, but not a little, of course. For such a four-eyed astronaut like you, the month of relationship is a dream. And my Antoine loves me very much. Who cares? I sleep here and you climb to the top. I'm just smart and I don't want to argue with you. And in general, the only thing that saves you is that I'm your neighbor. Otherwise, you would already be hanging on my chandelier. Clear? Yeah. Obviously. Ugh. What is that stench? What are you talking about? Your package stinks. <laughs> what is this? Are you starting a mold life at the school? Well, big deal. Food has gone bad a little. Now, why not eat it? Well, let me try it. One more word and I will do the same with you. Well, well, you will ask me to explain what a bisector is. What? No, nothing. It's a foreign language. Oh, heel. I broke my heel. The worst way to start the day. What's going on? Also, the spreadsheet says that I have to live in room number 22 with two losers. But Brittany always lives alone. But room 22? I'm not going to live with anyone. Moreover, I have a lot of stuff. What room do you say losers live in? Um, which one are you from? Well, if it is written to live together, then most likely nothing can be done. Everyone is equal in this school. Except your eyebrows. How could you pluck them so horribly? Here, take this money. Go to a good master. Wait, I really don't get it. Who are the losers here? Well, it seemed that she was talking about you. Yeah, right. Calm down and keep your distance. She doesn't want to live with us. I didn't know it was about you. Are no, you I told you, Stop I'm the queen here. I'm that. the you princess. No, you're Shut a loser. up! I got into the coolest school in the country and I won't let two live Barbies ruin my year. Live in threes. So threes. Big deal. You're making too much noise. Let's okay, go in the room. Okay, okay. I'll deal with it tomorrow. Wow, Emma. Pretended to be the group leader. Everyone understands that I am the leader. How good is it that I have a bunch of pairs of shoes? Wait, I'll go change my shoes. Do, 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 do. Oh. I guess here comes the neighbor. Hey, bro. Badass sneakers. Wow. Yours are good, too. So, I knew that I would have a crisp neighbor. You haven't heard my rap yet. Rap? No, thanks. I'm Tyler. I am Martin. So tell me, what cool thing have you seen here? Girls? Parties? Gossip? Intrigues? Investigations? You have chit on your lips. What? Are there many chicks in this school? This is what I like. I say, you are all in crumbs. Uh, why didn't you say that at first? Uh. What is that? Stop, stop, stop. Tyler, or whoever you are, put it back. No way, bro. With this, I entered the top one in the computer games championship. It was a great time. So are you a gamer? Didn't you recognize me? Um, no. Hey, Tyler Bagel 7000. I can't recall. Dude, you're just not into gaming, really. Everyone knows my nickname. Well, that's okay. You'll find out about me later. Uh, sure. 
Okay, I understand that we still have to live together. Looks like... Then we must have rules. I love rules. Number one, I choose bed first. Why would you? Well, because... Because my legs hurt. Problems since childhood. So it's clear that I sleep here. Well, okay. Then I'm up. Hey, and what about me? Oh, look. Here's the couch. Curl up, huh? And that's all. No, this is not working. Yeah, agree. There is something missing in the room. This changes everything. Actually, I didn't mean that. But now I'm wondering what kind of poster you dragged. It's the all ex-boyfriends board. Don't you have one? Of course she has. <laughs> this is not funny at all. Where will I sleep? It's probably her boyfriend calling. They've been together for a month. Yes, hello? Oh, I'm sorry. It's all right. Yes, I'm listening to you. By the law of nature, this is definitely not my classmate. Oh, and this is probably mine. <laughs> I'm on time always. Brittany! your mouth, boy, or a fly might get swallowed. He probably fell in love with us. Let's go. How beautiful she is, but damn, she'll never pay attention to me. Hey, why are you standing still? Now everyone needs to go to class and meet the headmaster. By the way, they say that he is very strict. Really? Yes. So come on. Hey. Hey. You got it. All wrong. It's so interesting what this headmaster looks like. I heard a lot about him. Never mind. Who cares about the wicked man in a jacket? Martin, look how beautiful the blonde is. Tyler, suck it up. You need to think about studying now. And I'm thinking about studying the art of flirting. Have you ever heard about Brittany. it? Brittany. There are guys whispering something about me. They probably can't share me. Yeah, for sure. Good afternoon. Lol, who's that? No matter who, but she will not become the queen of the school. Sorry for being late. Oh, he's not here yet. Phew. You are Chloe, right? Right, you're like a newbie? One more lateness, Chloe and you'll be out of school even faster than you were expelled from your previous one. I promise you this as the headmistress of the high school. Headmistress? Hey guys, thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget about the bell and leave a comment. And to see our video very first. Write in the comments which room Martin and I settled in. Bye, Bye everyone. everyone. Oh, because of this fire, I missed my manicure. I wish I could show my manicure to whoever did this. If only I could look at him, then he would look at my manicure. Oh, what a mess. I need a manicure right now. Ugh, fire alarm, emergency evacuation of Brittany. That's me, a beautiful and stylish girl. What's up, guys? Let's take it easy. That's definitely a drill. Wanna bet? I promise, if you give me your dirty, smelly hand again, then... What's up, guys? Let's take it easy. You will stay in the hospital, get it? Oh, uh, yuck. Emma, you have such beautiful pimples today. I don't even know which one to look at. Really? That is the best compliment I've ever received in my entire life. There was another one. The guy said my hair is like a horse's tail, and my smile is like the sun that doesn't shine. Hmm. Okay, I'll still have to live and study with her. Trash! 
Hey, is there anyone there? Better kill me right now than I'll be living and studying in the same class with them! All right. One of you set the false fire alarm. We will definitely find out who did it. And for this, he will be expelled from the school. So that you know that no one in our school will stand on ceremony with you. All one by one to my office. Nice. The second day of school and there will be minus one. So it's like a squid game or what? Minus one nail? Damn it. Need a manicure right now. You all just pissing me off. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve pimples. This is my favorite number. Yikes! I've got a bad feeling about all this. Martin, I bet you it was one of the girls who did it. That's chill, you know? Really relax, man. I mean, just like me, okay? Just chill, bro. Okay, Chloe, time is short. So tell me, why did you press the fire alarm button? You're just trying to chicken me out. Well, I mean, I was in class all the time chatting with my sweetie boyfriend. We've been together for a whole month. I miss him so much. Enough, Chloe. It's of course very interesting. But let's get down to business. If you tell me the truth, I'll let you throw a party. N really? Well, to be completely frank with you, I saw Martin leaving the classroom and he was gone for five minutes. No, wait, four, seven. Okay, thank you. You can go and get everything ready for the party, but this time without any fires. Oh, yeah, I love you. This party's gonna be the bomb. Chloe. Well, not in the sense of a bomb explosion, but I'll light it up. Well, I will light everything in the literal sense, but anyway, okay, everything Chloe. will be at the thank highest you. level. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Hold on, guys. There's such a din. See, bro? As I said, just chilling. Come on, Emma. Ladies first. Cool, man. Wow, bro. One, two, three. Oh, it's so nice of you. Emma, I need you to prepare an educational report. But what about the fire alarm? It's definitely not you. I have confidence in you. But I have a very interesting piece of information for you. I know a lot. I managed to watch everyone. By the way, one day I was reading a book and noticed you chatting on Instagram with our security guard. Emma, how good for you. Please go ahead and read your books. Don't like such smart girls. Also, I have good hearing. Sweetie, goodbye. Yeah, it's gonna be a total popping off. Call everyone. Check out my new pick. Oh, by the way, will there be a party? How did you get wind? Honey, I can understand everything from one conversation. I'm not stupid. Okay, not stupid. There will be a party, but without you. Well, let's take a look. So this one? Or no, maybe this one. Oh, this is perfect for my beauty. Hello, Brittany, are you deaf? I said no one is calling you there. Well, if the party is at school, then only students can be invited there. Come on, didn't you know? Oh, dang. Wait a second. What kind of party are you talking about? About the one you've never been to in your life. Oh, and I've been to Paris. I've also been to France. Uh, um, did I mention Paris? No one asked you where you've been. Wow, the first makeup in my life. The first party. And I hope the last. Well, well, so many things to do. Makeup, hair, beauty salon, spa. Where else would I spend my money? All right, so today at 6, I'm waiting for you at the party. I hope you will not come. Oh. So this is your sweet boyfriend, with whom you've been together for a whole month. And you even talk about him in your sleep. Yeah, this is him. It's not your business. Okay. 
So you say you two were in the class all the time and didn't go anywhere. Yep. yep. And you, Martin, you were in class all the time and didn't go anywhere. I told you. I, I didn't go out. Why do you bother me? I was in school all the time. Come on, bro. Just chill. Just chill. I'm sick of you, man. Just chill chilling. Don't you know other words? What a school. Such a nut house. May I be free? Yeah, Martin. Perhaps you need to calm down. Not you, too. What? I know other words I know. I'll probably just go and chill somewhere else. You can go. Yeah. I need to be more careful selecting students next year. I'm gonna try some new pickup lines for girls. Hey, beauty. Maybe you and me chilling around? No, I do not know other words. Watch yourself. Hey, Chica, next to me, it becomes restless. Just relax and chill, goddamn. And what about that? Hello, baby. You and me, here and there. You know, babe, if you are not with me, it does not mean that you are not with me. Ah, uh, I, I am. I'm just learning a poem here. I'll pretend I didn't see or hear it. Hey, beauty, I see you are restless. Tyler, these tricks don't work on me. And actually, I have a boyfriend. What's in your hands? Is it for me? Alas, yes. Tonight is our school opening party. And if suddenly, unfortunately, it doesn't work out for you, then you don't have to come. Nobody will be upset. Oh, come on. Today, I actually... Actually, I caught up in my stuff, but for you, I will have a free minute. Looks like there are as many things to do as you had girlfriends. <laughs> ah. Okay, guys, for the last time, since we have shared a toilet, you really need to actively use the toilet brush. Well, maybe toilet paper? Very funny. I see that this is going to be the best party of my life. Now, I need to rehearse how I'm going to dance. All right, I'm really sharp there. Now we decorate everything for the party very quickly. And after that, we're going to play. Yeah. Ah, let's go crazy. Oops, just slipped off. My apology. Why isn't everything here pink and rhinestones? This is not a party. Well, you can make your own pony corner and flex there. <gasps> Wowie, I will. Cut out the chatter. Let's get down to business. I love hanging out. Surprise! Howdy, this is awesome! Bro, what's that? Wow, girl! You're really something! I don't get it! So what about my party? What? There won't be a party? Guess I'll never get lucky enough in my life. How do I look? Guys, I have a surprise for you. In honor of our school's opening, I wanted us to get to know each other better. After all, we should live and study together. Alas. <laughs> hey, what's going on here? Martin, I didn't give you permission to have a party. And you, Brittany, are expelled from school because you set the false fire alarm. What? But you don't have any proof. You're the only one who hasn't come to me for questioning. And you, Martin, if you decide to have a party without asking for permission, you will be expelled too. Well, but I didn't do anything. <laughs> no, wait. It was me who set the fire alarm. No, it was me. Girls have nothing to do with it. I did it. Yeah, it was Martin. Ugh, I mean, I was chilling. Came up and pressed the fire alarm button. 
In this case, we're all leaving school. No, but wait, it can't be you. It can't be because of... Because of... Because of what? What? Please, I'm begging you. Let's prank them. Let's do what? I really want to surprise the guys, and I need your help. I'm not participating in your pranks. Pranks. It doesn't matter. I'm not participating. But this is a great way to rally everyone. Otherwise, you will have chaos. And you will lose the title of the best headmistress. And also, the most beautiful, smart, charming, amazing... Oh, Martin. All right. I'm in. What should I do? So that's it. It was me and Martin who arranged everything. And the fire alarm, I pressed it myself by accident. So what? No more party? No way. I brought you some chips, too. Oh. Have fun. <laughs> Guys, and now let's go dancing. <laughs> God damn, you do it freaking fun. Hey, honey, what's up? I miss you so much. I really, really miss you. Can't believe that tomorrow we will be exactly a month and three days. Love you. Mwah. Hey, guys. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to the channel. Don't forget about bell and writing comments. If you want to be the first to see the next video, then write in the comments which bar I ate in class. Bye, Bye everyone. everyone. Hey, Emma. Did you see Chloe? I can't find her anywhere. Hey, I'm talking to you. Do you hear me or what? What a nerd. I can hear everything clearly. Then why don't you answer? Are you deaf? No, I'm just not interested in where Chloe is and what she's doing. Because it's clear where she is and what she is. Got it. She's talking with her Aunt Tua again. I'm sick of it. Yeah, it's apparently true love. Hey, beauty. Hello, Tyler. Oh, well, hi. Heard the news? That I got a thousand more subscribers? That the meaning of life is not in the cognition of an object by the subject, but in awareness of the object as what? a subject? Okay, never mind. So what about your news? Today, we're going to have monitor election. Where? When? In class. Now. So why are we still here? Let's go. Yeah. Yeah, Brittany definitely has a crush on me. I can feel it. I have to become a monitor. Because firstly, I'm the best. Secondly, it's written in my planner. And thirdly, everything always goes according to my plan. I have to become a monitor. Firstly, because I have experience. And secondly, I wrote and most importantly, defended a research paper on the topic, Important Qualities of the Headman in Society. It should be me. Because there is no other options. I have to do it because... Damn, I didn't think of that. Although, no, stop, I got it. Oops, I forgot. So what am I doing here anyway? I don't understand. All candidates have spoken. I declare the election of the monitor of our school open. And may the best one win. The best in rap? Or in games? I didn't get what she said. She just said that Britney would win. Yeah, in your dream. I need to read all these books immediately. I need to pick out a dress ASAP. And by the way, how do you like the new dresser color? Yeah, love you too, honey. Bye. Chloe, why aren't you getting ready? Elections, after all. I don't care about them, and it's so clear. Are you not going to participate? Great. One opponent less. Naive. I'm soon to be the monitor of the school. I don't even have to lift a finger. From the point of view of manual erudition, it is possible. Blah, 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 blah. 
Okay, Chloe, let me know. What makes you think that you've already won? I let you. I like you too. I have a boyfriend. He will work it out for me. He's a cool one. But this is unfair. C'est la vie. All right, we'll see. If you only knew how many boyfriends I've had. I'm going to call each of them now. Get it? And I would call my grandmother. Well, simply just call. Damn! How could I blow everything? I prepared such a speech for the elections. It would definitely bring me to victory. Hey, bro! Don't you hear me? Oh, come on! Listen, bro, I don't have time for you right now. I'm trying to do my homework, and you're bothering me. Sorry, didn't mean to. Maybe you need my help? No thanks, I'll figure it out myself. Well, as you wish. Feel free to tell me if you... What a F. Did I drop it on purpose or what? I wouldn't feed the notebook with a candy bar on purpose. You're just driving me crazy. He's offended now. Why well, I'm not offended that his notebook devoured my bar. Damn, Chloe is ruining my whole plan. I should do something to knock her out of the thoughts in the election. But what? Oh, why would her boyfriend break up with her? Well, 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 Chloe and Martin. That's really interesting. <laughs> <laughs> when Antua sees these photos, he'll be so mad and leave her. Yeah, how smart I am. Yeah, I'm so smart, even without all these books. What does it mean without my homework? No! Oh, Brittany, I just had a nightmare. Yeah, I heard. What time is it now? It's time for me to see the director. <laughs> Ugh, come in, Emma. Oh, he... <laughs> How do you know it was me? Because this is your 20th visit to me in the last hour. Oops, really? So few? Apparently I didn't have time to ask all the questions. What do you want? I want to say that I am ready to start performing my direct duties. What do you mean by duties? After all, I am the monitor of our school. I must have some duties and I'm ready to start performing them. How's the monitor? Emma, we have elections only after class today. Miss Cooper? I think this was a waste of time. Let's think logically. Let's try. Martin refused to take part of his own free will. Brittany is not educated enough for this position. Chloe is constantly busy with her boyfriend. And Tyler? Well, you know. Hmm. Well, maybe you're right. Well, I'll think about it. Go, Emma. Yikes! That's you, Miss Cooper. I will not bother you anymore. Hope so. Okay, Emma. Didn't last long enough for you. Tyler? Oops. Excuses, Miss Cooper. The wrong door. Have a nice day. And Eve. Well, have a nice morning, too. Bye. <sighs> Ooh, calm down. It's just kids. Da -da 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 -da. Brittany, that's da -da -da. enough. I can't concentrate on my book. We have an election in an hour, and I still have to read 15 books. I feel like Chloe won't give Forget up. Forget it, bookworm. Just like that. I've got everything pumped up. I didn't understand. Retrained or what? <laughs> Brittany, tell me what you have already thought up. I'll make sure Chloe can't win the election. But how? She's got a boyfriend who will take care of everything for her. Consider he's gone. Antoine, Antoine, please, can we just talk and decide everything? Please wait. I don't understand. Why is it always like this? As soon as I start to sincerely fall in love with someone, they immediately leave me. Chloe, are you crying? Don't touch me. I didn't even mean to. Chloe, what happened? Antoine broke up with me. Who? My boyfriend, Brittany. No way. Maybe you didn't get it right. No, Brittany. I get everything right. People make mistakes. Think so? Of course. Oh, he 
you wrote something. Give me your phone. We will see ourselves what Antua wrote to you. Sorry, Chloe, but I can't be with you anymore. Farewell. Yes, he really did it. You can't even imagine how I feel. <laughs> Don't worry, Chloe. You'll make up, I'm sure. No, nothing will be as it was. He left me. And now I definitely won't become the monitor. <laughs> you will make a good actress. Don't get it. To play like nothing happened? Talent. But I didn't do anything, Emma. You know, maybe I'm a nerd who doesn't understand anything in a relationship. But still, I understand you didn't mean. It's a new well. You see how it hurts her. No, Emma, I really didn't do anything. I don't believe you. You betrayed your roommates. And that's unforgivable. Oh, yeah, I'm withdrawing my candidacy for the election of the monitor. I don't need elections like that. And such opponents, too. But I really didn't do anything, Emma. I didn't have time. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry. Really, he's not worth it. You're beautiful. Smart. Of course. It's easy for you to say. Now you just have every chance to become the monitor. And for me, it won't happen at all. And now it doesn't chime for me at all. And even the boyfriend left me. Just left, you know. Well, do you want me to withdraw my candidacy from the election? So that you have more chances to win? Especially since Emma also refused. And there are no more candidates. Would you do it for me? Of course, Chloe. You are my roommate. But what about Tyler? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Tyler is definitely a win-win option. Losing a boyfriend, I found your support. Thank you, Brittany. Whoa, don't go overboard. You know, I say to her, so what? And she's just like, yeah, what? And I told her, well, what? Let's go. And she's like, yeah, why not? Funny, yeah? That's how I met her when I was five years old. I don't get it. Why are you in my shirt? Okay, Ma, I have to go. I've just met my, um, business bro. We need to talk. Bye. Hey, bro, what's up? Cool shirt, man. Yeah, thanks, bro. But she's mine. Why did you wear it? But we're kind of best friends, yeah? Ugh. By the way, where are the girls? Elections in five minutes. No idea. Maybe already in class? Bro, you're so smart. Let's go then. Don't forget to return the shirt. Dear high school students, I'm glad to inform you that the elections were held with dignity. Each of you showed everything that he is capable of. So it is time to announce the winner. Uh, Tyler, where are the girls? Believe it or not, Miss Cooper, I asked myself this question too. You flirt with them, show them game master's hands, but they still don't have a crush. Oh, you're talking about former candidates for the monitor? So they... Uh, dude! The headmistress asks about Emma, Brittany, and Chloe. Uh, they refused to go. What do you mean refused? They just figured out who's boss here. It's impossible. Unfortunately, no. Well, since we have no other option, as a school monitor is appointed, Tyler. Yeah! We did it, bro! Just imagine how the school will change under my rule! Unimaginably. Yeah, unimaginably. So first rule, my best friend Martin get a free hit! <laughs> I'm just gonna... I'm just kidding! Kidding! Funny. Yeah. Hey, Emma! Heard the news? Are you moving to a new school? Mm, no. Maybe you're being evicted from our room. I said no. Where did you get it? It's strange. Okay. Then I'll have to ask the headmistress about it. But for what? Because you betrayed Chloe. I already told you I didn't do anything. That's how I believe you. And Tua just decided to leave Chloe for no reason. Yeah, I wanted to frame Chloe so that her boyfriend would break up with her and she wouldn't win the election, but I... What did you want to do? Chloe! Guys, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe to our channel and click the bell. And to be the first to see our video, write in the comments the name of our headmistress. Now, excuse me, I have to run. Chloe and Brittany had a fight. 
Bye everyone! Hey, you damn it, monitor! How long are you gonna sit on the toilet for? By the way, according to the rules, everyone can be there for no more than 15 minutes, but not two hours. Tyler! I'm not going along with a shared toilet! I can't believe I was born so beautiful! Good morning, Tyler! Did you lose your tongue? <laughs> Chloe, you're so funny. <laughs> excuse me, but what were you doing in there for two hours if you're still so gross? I excuse you too. Uh, dude, the rules are the same for all. Then read them, please, more carefully. What? what? Wrong one. First, listen to Tyler. Second, listen to Tyler carefully. That's the way it is. We need to put them in place. Agree. Without you, Brittany, don't come to me never again. Hey, there's a cue. Apparently, I won't be in time for an additional lecture. Okay, I want my car to be ready in five minutes. Later, Gator. The cues are not for me. I'm going to the beauty salon. <laughs> Why so quiet? Can't be any louder. No, that's the maximum. You're dummy. People are resting. Someone might also study. But there's no one. What about me? Well, you don't rest. Hey, let it be. Do you want a sausage? No, thanks. Wait, where did you get the sausages? Chloe, come on, in the fridge. I know, because these are my sausages. Tastes great. All food is shared. Hey, guys. What are you doing here? Martin, why are you so happy? Kind of holiday or what? Well, sort of. Guys, quick, quick, come here. What happened? Look! Sausage man! You got it? <laughs> Chloe, hello! I would like to apologize again. I don't really- Enough! I can't take it anymore! I'll have breakfast separately! Ah, uh, wait for me, Chloe. <sighs> After all, if a person has talent, then he has talent in everything. After all, real talk. Okie dokie, yup. I'm gonna go to the salon. Here's your new friend. <laughs> yeah, really trash story. Hey, I'm a bon appetit. Thank you. Huh? Why are you so happy? Did the scholarship arrive? No, today's just my... Oh gosh, how she pisses me off! What are you doing? This is for my boyfriend! But that was a new top from the latest collection! Here, take it. Just look, what a defender! So, every day at 8, everyone yells, Tyler's badass! No, it's dumb, everyone knows that. 
Yes, thank you. Yes, thank you very much. I'm very pleased. Thank you. Yes. Why are you all day long on gadgets? Life's over before you know it. Is this a gamer telling me? This coming from a gamer? Exactly, bro. You killed it. We need to make a video game room now. Well, today's just my... That's freaking cool. It couldn't be any freaking cooler. Psst. Cool birthday. I'm all alone. There's no friends. There's no one. Psst. Awesome. I hate this school. I hate everyone. What's that? Ew, that's pink. You forgive me? You look amazing in this dress. You look better in that torn t-shirt. This is my gift for you. I'm sorry, I didn't really post anything. What are you staring at? You are so beautiful. This dress really suits you. Any guy is yours. All right, Will you forgive me? never mind. He's such a jerk. How could I even be with him? Perfect. Forgive me for that shirt too. Okay, enough gushing. I don't like it when there are too many. <laughs> what happened? Did you get an F mark? Did you break your nail? Show me. I lost my favorite glasses. How did it happen? I forgot them in the bathroom, and when I came back, they were gone. Don't worry, we'll buy new ones. What are these glasses for anyway? I've got something for you. Here you go. What is this? Manicure certificate? It's useless if she can't see anything. Open it first. Wow. But what is that? So, do I now have lenses? What? Is it not beautiful? It suits, it suits you, so you so well. well. Yay! I also want to invite everyone to the cafe. All on me. Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's it. The hog limit is over. <laughs> now, why is this car so skidding? Hey, yo, bro. Guess who's got a surprise for you, man? Oh, finally, bro. I even thought you forgot. Come on. What do you take me for? How could I forget such a thing? <laughs> yeah, and most importantly, all day today, I've been trying to tell everybody Ta -da! that. Um... Uh, well, I mean, it's better than nothing. Yeah, remember I took your socks? So, here they are. <laughs> Could have at least washed them. Wow, now I can see even better. Brittany, have you always had such pink things? All the time. Can you see your pimples even better now? <laughs> <laughs> Jokes, I'm just kidding. Wow, Brittany, but what about keeping fit? This is for you. How caring you are. What? Just need a little calcium for my brain. Yeah, tell that to Tyler, who's eating and getting <laughs> more dumb. Girls, let me take a <laughs> selfie. Hey, one more time now. I turned out really horribly. Took the girls to the cafe all on me. Publish. Thanks, Brittany. What? Did you say something? Never mind. Bro, you said you were full at home. Yeah, I was. So why are you asking? No, never mind. Just curious. By the way, Martin, you've got a holiday today. Finally. Today's International Sun's Day. You are a son, and I'm a son. Oh wait, I'm a son too. So where are my congrats? Oh look, girls, let's go. Oh, hi Martin. Hey Brittany. So how do you like my new rules? I sent it to everyone on Insta. How dumb are they? Just like, like you. Like you? Oh, so do you like me? By the way, are you without glasses? I now wear lenses. By the way, have you already made up? Something like that. Guys, all day I've wanted to say that. I'm also going to make a Skipmon program. 
What is that about? I'm hearing this for the first time. Skip is about missing and Mon is money. So what? We don't get it anyway. Skip the class. Paid me money and I do not mark you in the journal. That sounds interesting. Here we go. That's a year ahead. Wow. Deal, babe. But you can't do that. Stupid rules. Yeah, man. You overdid it. And in fact, we don't like you as a monitor. For the first time ever, I agree with Chloe. Hey, I'm worried sick. I'm all for you. Worry, can't find a place, don't sleep at night. Eat constantly. Eat consistently? Oh, I mean, you'll value you only when you lose. Why are you starting? Take it easy. How much easier? I mean, how is it even possible to be such a- Martin, don't push it. He's kind of nervous today. You must be pissing him off. Monitor and you are incompatible phrases. Yeah. Incompat. Incompat. Come on, girls. There's no point in telling him twice. Yeah. No way. Damn it. Guys, I penciled you in the school assessment journal. Guys, write in the comments, am I a cool headman or a very cool one? Why so satisfied? Five more lessons tomorrow. Really? Of course now. So why are you so happy? It seems to me that Martin fell in love with me. <laughs> Martin in love with you? <laughs> That's why he didn't even notice that you weren't wearing glasses. <laughs> yeah, with me. He wants to say something all day. Apparently to confess his feelings. Have you lost your sanity along with your glasses? Have you ever looked at yourself in the mirror? But of course, I am more impressed by Tyler. I don't know how to refuse Martin. Hey you! You'll never have a boyfriend in your life, especially one like Martin. But... But... But what? Go read your books. <laughs> the library will be closing soon. You! You! Classy. Sassy. Stunning. Wicked. Heartless! Why you gotta be so sensitive? I am never going to have a boyfriend. Better watch yourself. Oh, my glasses. Finally! Why do I need lenses? Even with them, I don't become prettier. <laughs> Emma, did you find the glasses? Yes. <laughs> Emma, why are you making a pool of tears here? Again in the glasses? So it's your fault? I have nothing to do with this pimply girl. She herself was offended by something and blame me. Yora! Brittany, you're sitting comfortably at my desk. Pardon. She's kind of angry. And where are the boys? Well, apparently getting ready for Martin's birthday. Martin's, Martin's birthday? birthday? Why are you late for class? Just because it's Martin's birthday doesn't mean you can all relax. Here we no are way. again. This is complete confusion. Well, do you want to say something? Martin is gone. I can't find him anywhere. What, what do, do you mean, mean gone? gone? Guys, we'll go look for Martin. Thank you very much for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel. Like and don't forget the bell. If you want to be the very first to see our next video, then write in the comments what is hanging on the bed in the boys' room. Bye, Bye everyone! everyone. <laughs> Tyler, I'm so glad you finally confessed your feelings for me. Tyler, you are the best guy I've ever met in my entire life. Cool. Two beauties of our school have a crush on me at the same time. Tyler, didn't you forget about me?
What are you doing here? This is my boyfriend. What? Got your wires crossed? He's mine. Actually, I was the first to notice him. You don't even see anything. How could you notice someone? Yep, he's my boyfriend. Girls, no, girls, mine, relax. Mine. There's plenty of me for everyone. No way. You have to choose Brittany or me. Or me. But I can't do that. I like you all at once. What? Tyler, we have an important meeting. Yeah, yeah, I know. I choose... Hmm, let me think. Hmm, okay. Poor boy. Obviously, he went completely crazy amid the stress. It's hard to lose your best and only friend. Yeah, so hard that he can't spend five minutes without sleep. All right, girls, let's just stay on point. Martin's gone, and we need to find him now. Who knows anything about him? Yeah, pretty sad. Oh, maybe Tyler knows? He lives in the same room with him. He must have heard or seen something. Looks like a fat chance. Then we need to separate and find out everything we can. Good. Maybe then we'll find clues. I'll go to the headmistress's office, Brittany to the boys' room, and Emma... To the library. And what's he gonna do? He has already found what to do. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no wonder Martin disappeared. It is not difficult to do in such a mess. Maybe he's somewhere here, under the rubble. Ew! No, I can't stay here. I need to change the location to a more pleasant one. Ah. <sighs> hey! It's kind of a joke or what? Anybody hear me? Open the door! Damn! No one can hear me. Ah. Uh, I'd rather go to the library with Emma. At least it doesn't stink. And the connection is much better there. Strange. Nobody answers. Hmm. Cool. The door is open. There's no headmistress. So the office is completely on my hands. Hmm. Well, well. Let's see. All right. Breathe in. Emma, breathe out. Phew. Better now. Because of Martin's disappearance, I'm all stressed. But my antidepressants are always with me. <sighs> but nothing bad happened, right? Martin is an adult guy. He will definitely come back. Even though he disappeared on his birthday. Hmm. I wonder if he remembers me. Oh no, not again. I need to start reading now. I hope the girls have everything under control. Eh, uh, I can't even connect to my Instagram. What a life. What if Tyler chose the right strategy? I can go to sleep and come up with an idea how to find Martin. Well, or at least how to get out of here. Mm. At least the bed is comfy. Or not. Seems it was a hurry decision. Martin's diary? Well, that's interesting now. So, athlete's notes. Rating of the most reliable cars for 2021? It doesn't make sense. Why is there so little anime or seinen manga? What? My perfect girlfriend? Whoa, that's something. So what do we have here? Smart, beautiful, the one who can share my interests, understanding, responsible. Modest, polite, kind. Well, and 150 more points. Until he finds such a girl, it will take... Never mind, just a long time. He could just write, I need a Britney-like girl. Although, I am one of a kind. So unique. Okay. Is there really nothing useful in this diary to find Martin? Hmm. I 
I hate school. I hate my classmates. Hate? Well, great. Now I'm an excellent student like Emma. I corrected all my grades. Let someone just try to say that I'm wrong. Now everyone has proof. <gasps> Oh, such a kindergarten, not a school. Phew. Calm down, Cooper. Your vacation is coming. You just have to wait. Wait just for... For half a year? No way. I can't stand them all. Guess who can say the same? Don't get it? Let me ask. What's happening here? Oops. Hello. Oh, yes, um... So what? I'm just, um, I'm just looking Your for... Your application for expulsion from school? So know that it will appear on my table very soon. Uh, well, in general, I wanted to complain about Tyler. He couldn't handle his responsibilities. I don't have time to figure this out, Chloe. There is something wrong with you every day. I'm fed up with it but, all. But, uh... No buts. Go to your class. I don't want to see you here again. But, Miss Cooper, I just wanted to know... Did you hear me wrong? I... I am... <laughs> oh damn. I didn't find out anything about Martin. Guys, where do you think Martin went? Write in the comments. Phew, the last one. It was quite interesting. But nothing useful to find Martin. So what? Did you find out something? Yes, it turns out that it is possible to reject tendencies of paradoxical illusion, just as every inadequate individual has his own point of view. Yeah, and now explain how it will help us to find Martin. Unfortunately, it won't. So do you mean that you haven't found out anything about Martin in all this time? And what did you manage to do? And I, I, you know, it's not your business. Yeah, sure. And where is Brittany? You sent her to the boys' room. Or have you already forgotten? I didn't forget anything. I hope she managed to figure something out. Need to call her. So what? Out of reach. A mystical school where people disappear. Yeah. Store in the scarecrow, nerd. Do you think I can succeed? Have no doubt. But this is not the point. Now we have two people missing. We need to find them now. I propose to start with the boys' room. Brittany was there. <laughs> hey, bro. Wow. Hey, man. Where have you been? We looked for you. Yeah, I see. I couldn't stand it and came by myself. Well, sorry for it all, right? You know, the status of the school monitor turned my head. So many stuff to do, everyone needs me. I see. So, where have you gone, man? Well, I wanted to throw a party. So I went to go buy everything that I needed for this. Dude, so you were lost. I'm so glad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, here I am. But uh, could you do me a favor? Can you help me get ready? Whatever you want, bro. After all, I was so wrapped up that I completely forgot about the time. No problems, but wait a sec. I'll just go to the loo. Uh, of course. Nice to see you again. I was only gone for a couple hours, but yet I already missed everything. I don't like it. Wait! What's wrong? Although we are not best friends, I doubt that we will ever become... Hmm, sounds sweet. Listen, you, nerd, don't interrupt, huh? Okay. I just want to warn you that I've been in this room before, and it's just awful. Ah, don't worry. I've seen it all. I once read about how... No, 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 don't push it. I just wanted to warn you. Don't listen to another lecture from Miss All Knowing. Thanks for the compliment, but I still have to study and learn. Let's deal with this after we find Brittany and Martin. Wait! What again? And I want to say that you are not as bad as you seem. Uh. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I don't want to interrupt your idol, but I would like to get out of this dump as soon as possible. 
We will rescue you! Hold on! Ugh. Here you are! And that's all you did? Man, do you know how hard it was to unpack these candles and then stick them in? I got it. I'll have to do everything myself. Oh yeah, just pick me up if needed. Can I ask you then? What? Now? So fast? Just please, find Brittany, Emma, and Chloe. Get a hold of them. And then I'll tell you when you can come, okay? Yes, sir. <laughs> well, Martin, happy birthday to you. Only the surprise is not made for me, but vice versa. <laughs> Girls, I'm sorry, but who knew? That the door can be open not only pulling, but also pushing. <laughs> but it was quite funny. <laughs> I mean, that's great. We found Brittany. But I wasn't lost at all. It wasn't enough just to say thank you for getting you out of here. Given that we're still sitting here then... I won't say thanks. Well, I see. Emma, we are not welcome here. Perhaps we should go. Wait. Maybe Brittany found something about Martin and we can find him. <sighs> okay, then. At least you're of some use. Brittany, tell us. Did you manage to find something out about Martin? Let's say. Oh, hey. Here you are. Oh, hey, here you are. How is sleeping and dreaming? Well, let's say... I see nothing you... I mean, I found Martin. Where? Where? Tyler never reveals his secrets. Tyler, you're such an attaboy. Yeah, it's me. So where was he? Speak! These are our boyish secrets. You won't get it. Hey, wait! Tyler, what's wrong? Well, you know, I mean... Go on, we're interested. I just want to say that I like you. All at once. What? what? Tyler, so what are you talking about? Who do you like? Just never mind. I'm kidding. What a sense of humor. Let's go. You're in for a surprise. What? What, what surprise? Phew! Dodged a bullet. Surprise! Martin! <laughs> <laughs> Martin, where were you all this time? I wanted to throw a party. And when I bought everything, I went to a cafe and... And I offered to help him. Well, like that. <laughs> Guys, I'm so glad everything turned out well. And we are all together now. Martin, don't get lost anymore. Hold back, Emma. I found out something about our missing. It turns out that our Martin is keeping a diary. Ew, dude. How dare you? And it says he hates our school and everyone who studies here. What? what? Is it true? Guys, I kept this diary when I was on my last day of school. It was really awful, but here, I found true, <laughs> and at the same time, different friends. Someone give me a napkin. I'm gonna cry. Here, Martin, it's yours. Please. Sorry I misunderstood everything, and you know... Brittany, I'm not offended, really. All is well. The main thing is that we're all here together. <laughs> <laughs> and I also want to say something. Happy birthday, Martin! Yay! <laughs> Yay! Yay! By the way, I will be pleased if you'll like and comment in honor of my birthday. Also, write in the comments what message Martin sent me. Bye! Bye, Bye everyone! <laughs> Yay! In the next episode... Back off! You are not my mother to tell me what to do! I'm running and a fish is following me. I sniffed it and it smells like ice cream. <laughs> I wish I could be first and best in everything again. <laughs> Brittany? General absenteeism. I will expel you all from school.